Hi everybody, Alex Deployer from Expert Forex and in today's video we're going to be looking at a huge exceptional robot that gives a 100% return every day with 95% accuracy on that target. So this video is going to be an exceptional video and I hope you watch it right to the end where we show you each of these trades happening one by one and you could see this in action in front of your very own eyes. Now recently we started two competitions, the Grid Trend Multiplier Trading Challenge for this year and we also started the Make Money Robot Trading Challenge which is currently active, the Grid Trend Multiplier multiplier is over and you can see the returns have been pretty good 800% over two month period and 400% over about a six week period. So uh, looking at these results and looking at, at uh, analyzing what the, the successful traders have done we realize that what they are doing is they're using our set and forget EAs as basically scalping tools. So we realize that is one of the most neglected areas because we've been focusing on set and forget plug and play type of approaches to these EAs. And that's basically kicked off the investigation into using some of our robots as scalpers. So the first thing that we learned was short term charts, one minute to five minute charts produce better results. In, in the case of the grid trend multiplier it doesn't use a time frame but what happened there was instead of using 20 pip gaps it actually uh, the winners were actually using three pip gaps so that's a, another way of accelerating the trading. The other thing that, w that came out is single direction trading has often been the basis of the winners of these competitions. So in other words they would either trade a buy or a sell they wouldn't be trading both directions. A lot of them achieved what they wanted to achieve in very short periods. In fact, some of the leaders only have traded for two to three hours in fa to generate 200 to 400% returns. So you don't need lots of time. They have achieved it in a very short time. However, leverage is an incredibly important factor in this trading and certainly uh, leverage of a thousand to one or even two thousand to one would be required to achieve these above average results. Now they all use multipliers. Now there are two types of multipliers. You can use a rapid trading multiplier which basically enters a trade every on every candle if um, if a trading signal occurs on that particular candle so you could end up with oh, well over 100 trades open at the same time. That's the one type of multiplier. The other um, multiplier is basically just the percentage of equity. So as your equity goes up, you would risk more or if it goes down, you would risk less. So there are two types of multipliers. In this example that you're going to see today, we only use the uh, candle by candle multiplier but uh, in certain cases, the equity um, or increasing your position sizing in, re in relation to your account size is a nice way of multiplying your account. And then we came to the last area, which was our area of concern, which was that most of these winners were using manual entries. So in other words, they were identifying a, a setup and then activating the EA and they were would also exit on that basis. So... The EA was just doing all the hard work of trading in, the, in a particular way, but they were activating and closing the EA off uh, on a manual basis, on a judgmental basis. And that was disappointing about the uh, competitions in, in that we could not roll that out as a set and forget or continuous trading concept until now. Because running with these items that we've learned we've actually come up with an approach to automate scalping and when you see the live trading it will all make sense to you okay so what are the changes we made to the make money ea and when we make a, a change to an ea it is generally an upgrade and all upgrades are free so existing make money owners will get this upgrade for free 
we've added a single direction option. In other words, you could decide whether you want to go long, whether you want to go short, or whether you want to trade both directions. So we've added that. We've also added a daily target. So when the trading starts in the day, on, on that particular day, as the trading progresses and you reach a particular target that's been set, um, it will stop the trading. It'll just close all the deals and that will be the end of the day's trading. And you'll see examples of that. Then uh, we've added an equity stop loss where it restricts the, the maximum amount of equity that you can lose in a drawdown. So in other words, so in other words, as the daily trading happens and uh, you start making an equity loss, it, uh, that is the same as a stop loss. You, you can limit your exposure to that. And then we've changed the time of day trading period logic. So in other words, we've said you can set the time, the, the start time for opening trades and the end time for opening trades. And But when the end time is reached all the all the trades will be closed so that's the change in logic that we've done uh, for for scalping you, you can choose between scalping or continuous trading if you choose scalping this kind of logic will apply at the end of the period just close all the deals okay so the question is how do you get your hands on this EA we are not going to actually officially launch this EA for another three to four weeks and the reason for that is that we want it to be beta tested by our premium advantage forum members for the next three weeks and we also want them to use this EA to enter the competition that is acceptable they can enter the competition using this version of the make money ea and use these new settings that we've added to see what kind of returns they can make in the three weeks that are left in this competition so if you are already a member all you would do is you would go down to uh, benefit seven the ability to beta test new trading robots the robot isn't there right now it will be there in two to three days the beta version and you can start trading it straight away enter the competition and start using it in the competition the other way of getting hold of the make money ea there are five other ways so you can just buy it outright on our website which is expertforex.com or you can purchase it as part of our three ea bundle there it is uh, you can also get it free by opening a broker account go and have a look at that just click on that particular banner and uh, it is also included in the if the 75 percent off robot bundle that's the fourth way and then the fifth way as i've shown you previously if you join the the forum you actually get a above average discount to forum members okay let's get into the actual trading and let's look at the setup that we will be using firstly we're going to be trading the pound yen we're going to use one lot per transaction using a ten thousand dollar account and that one lot's going to be fixed for the period we're going to use a maximum open trade setting, which is a standard setting in the current Make Money EA. And when it reaches the maximum uh, uh, open trades, then it will close the most profitable trades to make room for the next one. Uh, there'll be no stop loss because trading the one minute time frame you are always trading in the direction of the trend especially if you're using fast settings and therefore uh, if, if if there's a runaway trend you're going to be in it anyway so there's no need for a stop loss uh, there will be a target of 55 pips uh, there's no trailing or break even stops uh, the time there will be time of day settings and this varies from currency to currency some currencies only trade two hours a day others trade four hours a day some trade a lot more than that so uh, uh, we will be using a time of day setting uh, the account targets so in other words the gain on the account every day we're going to set a target of 120 percent a day and uh, we'll see that that is hit quite often and the maximum equity drawdown uh, is uh, 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 is another setting one of the new settings that we've brought in and that's most probably going to be around about 20 percent 
Um, uh, now, the one thing that is very important for this trading, because there's going to be a lot of open trades, is you need high leveraged accounts. So a thousand to one is what we're going to be using for this trading. Uh, but you could even go to two thousand to one or three thousand to one if you're so lucky. Then we're going to use very fast moving average settings and uh, ADX settings. In other words, in other words, when a trend changes, we want to be in it and facing in the right direction. So when I say fast, we're talking about maybe three or two for the moving averages. And at the ADX, uh, we don't want it to interfere. So we're going to set it for a level of 10 or 5, even basically neutralizing it. Uh, we're going to uh, trade longs and shorts, and you'll see that we're doing it to be buys and sells, although it is possible to actually get a better results trading selected directions on a day to day basis. Uh, and we're going to be trading the whole month of June. Now, you're going to see on the actual trading that the price action does everything that is possible it, it, it goes flat it, tr it trends it whipsaws it goes it just doodles sideways so so this test is actually going to be pretty representative of most of the market conditions that you can encounter so that's the setup for the test before we go into the test let me show you the results of the test uh, uh, we've had a nice increase from ten thousand dollars to almost a quarter of a million dollars uh, over the period of june and again i must remind you we're using fixed lots there so there's no multiplier effect by using percentage of equity there's a very high success rate as you'll see that most of the days the target is hit and the the consequence of this extremely high success rate there was a 95 percent success rate in this particular example is that uh, if you start with a hundred dollars and you uh, and you double it every day you can get to a million dollars within 15 days and this is basically what we're going to see to today is uh, an incredibly high success rate and i'm not basically saying that this is repeatable i'm just giving you the calculation to give you an idea of the power of what you're about to see and i must remind you this is a simulated trading in other words it's back trading using historical data and testing the ea to see what potential the ea has nothing more than that it's not a promise of future profitability at all we have basically said have we got a very powerful ea or not and just by doing a, a number of back tests it seems like we do have one okay we in the strategy tester I have loaded the make money a daily close EA. Uh, we have the pound New Zealand. I'm using open prices for the speed because if you use tick data, it will take me very long. But the difference between open prices and tick data is not that different because decision making is made on the close of the candle anyway, which is a, exactly the same method as the open prices. And we're going to be running the month of June and it, we're going to be doing it in visual mode. So all I need to do is click on start. OK, all I have to do is click on start and it will start and it has loaded the pound yen one minute chart up there. Um, I'm going to decrease the size just a little bit and increase the speed at which the chart will run and then we activated and there it goes so now it's trading quite quickly and i'm going to just pause it at that point so you as you can see it takes trades in the direction of the trend most of the times so you can see there uptrend is buys downtrend is sell uptrend up 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 down and then up again so it's always trading in the direction of the trend it opens a trade on every single candle and there are the particular trades the targets for this for the this is these are the targets for the sales and here are the targets for the buys they they hidden away it's it's about 55 it's 55 pips away so it takes a while for them to hit those targets so i'll just set this off again release the pause and away it goes and it's buying 
in the direction of the cell, the tr trend and selling in the direction of the trend. Just need to pause that. Now, you can see that it's a whole lot of trades that have closed profitably. Uh, and how that happens is that when it reaches the maximum number of open trades allowed, it will then start closing the most profitable deal that it can find to make room for new trades. So although these trades have not hit their targets, they are their targets, uh, they are being closed profitably on a continuous basis um, to make room for new trades. Okay, let's let it go again and I'm going to reduce it even further just to give you a feel and there it's just going doing the normal thing trading in the direction of the trend closing uh, positive deals and so on so there it's going trading up oh, all right so there it's actually stopped for the day so let's stop the trading so remember that profit uh, figure that we had of 1,200? It's reached that 1,200 figure. And when it reaches that figure, it closes all the deals. Boom. Closed for the day. It's now going to relax and not trade for the rest of the day. So that's how it works. So it's, it's, a, it's a, a day scalper. And when it reaches its target, it stops for the day and takes it easy. So I'm going to just forward this until the next day Oops, too fast but all right there's the next day so it started the next day we're now on the 2nd of june you can see there was a big buy phase that went up there a lot of closed buy trades happening there and there it's trading away and uh, the same thing will hopefully happen again when it reaches a oh, okay it's hit its target there and again it's gone over the target that's 13,500 so it's gone over the the target and mainly because there's fast movements at the end here but it closes all of the deals so let's continue to the next day and there it's off to the next day and again I'll make it a little bit smaller you can see the overall picture a little bit better so it'll only start trading at the time that you have specified during the next day and it will trade until either the target is hit or the period that you specified for trading stops. Now because it hit the target quite quickly it's uh, trading still trading on oh, oops oops that's a problem this thing jumps quite quickly going to just stop it so it started trading on the 3rd of june as you can see again ent entering trades in the direction of the trend as as best it can uh, when it's a downtrend a lot of sells and it's an uptrend a lot of buys and you can see hundreds of trades open but it does close the most profitable deals on an ongoing basis i'm going to just make this a little bit smaller again you can see the uh, you can see that this particular movement on this day is incredibly sideways there's the the target and there's the stop 55 pips away so that is only a range of about 200 uh, uh, 20 pips at the most and uh, what I'm going to do is I will just increase the size uh, this I'll, I'll release it to trade again and there it goes um, let's see what happens with this one now this is trading really sideways you, you can see that all right, there's caught a bit of a trend and it's closed at $12,000. So that's basically how it works. Um, this is now June the 3rd. So let's go through the whole month. I know you might find it a bit laborious after a while, but you can see that it really trades in in quite a varied price action manner because it's trading the one minute. Uh, the pound yen was selected in particular because it is such a volatile currency. It trades all over the place all the time and trades quite uh, quite actively and therefore it's, oh, there's the start of the 4th of June. So there we are. We've got a, a, a nice trend that's developed there and let's see how long it takes to hit its target. There it's already started closing a lot of positive deals and um, let's just wait then. So 
So it's never allowed to open more deals than what you specify. So okay, there we go. Let's stop that one. So it's it's hit its target. Uh, that's 12,500. Hit its target 4th of June around about two o'clock. So um, and then it's closed all of the trades. And let's just continue. There we are. So I'm trying to make it uh, run at a reasonably good speed because we've got a whole month to get through. We're only on the 4th of June right now, but it's worth seeing all the trading happening. And should you want to see more detail, what I would suggest you do is you, you pause the screen at certain times to see the price action that has happened. So again, all right, so now, all right, there we are into the new day and trading has started, basically opening trades on every one minute candle and they already have uh, quite a few trades have been cashed in positively. Again, you know, if we look down where are the targets uh, and, and the stops, oh, that was very quick. Let's just analyze this day's trading. Um, started at zero hour in other words midnight it started at midnight and by eight o'clock even before the uk market or the us market opened before then it already achieved its target for the day so that's quite interesting uh that that is that is basically how quickly it, it, it happened because this was quite a nice trend and i think that's what happened there so uh, let's just activate it again and go into the next day so sometimes these uh, uh targets can be hit quite quickly that was an eight hour period not bad uh, and uh, so far we've got a hundred percent success rate Let's go. I'm going to make this a bit faster. Oop. Oof. Problem, there's, there's, there's no difference between fa fast and very, very fast. So this is what's happened. It's just started trading very quickly. Let me open it up a little bit, see if we can see more detail. Okay, so this is fairly, fairly sideways and uh, all over the show. Again, it, it reaches the point where it starts cashing in the positive trades. Um, and... Uh, and so on as it's going on and you can see how far it is from the actual i don't think we've seen many of these trades actually hitting oops hitting their start their targets at all so again um uh, the daily target figure has been hit stop trading it's uh it's this time it went to 1500 hours so this time it traded quite a bit of the day but as i say some some currencies only trade for uh, a few hours a day this one t uh, trades a little bit longer so we'll just accelerate it Let's see if i can get a sm small acceleration very difficult to monitor the speed of this thing there we are all right there it starts okay too fast all right there we are so I'll open it up make it let's have a look again it's a very sideways market this one um let's open it up very sideways now it's taking a bit of a a, a bear a, a bullish trend and see all the buys being cashed in there and um now it's up oh, there we are so stop again there's the daily target being hit so I think you're starting to get an idea. It opens a whole lot of trades. Um, uh, when it's reached its maximum, it starts cashing in the positive trades, the most positive trade to make room for new trades. And then overall, because it's in the majority of cases, it's trading with the trend all the time. Uh, eventually, uh, the with the trend trades overpower the against the trend trades and you get a positive result coming out now this is the 9th of june so we've only done a third of the of the month and let's just continue with that particular one again i'll try and forward it without oh there we are all right so it started on the 10th of june again 
uh, if you look at it in perspective it's very sideways um, it's actually starting in the quiet time of the uh, market there's a lot of cash ins that have happened there are lots of reds coming through lots of reds there and let's see how long it takes to even out it's it's the balance between the reds and the blues the blues are the buys and the reds are the sells now here's an example let's stop it here you can see it it's it went out at at thirteen thousand dollars if we had stayed in this there's a good chance that this could have run right up to a a return or a a, 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 a a 200% return for the day that this particular one could potentially have become a 200% return for the day anyway let's let's carry on now we're on the 10th so we're going to be trading on the 11th next <laughs> trying to fast forward it okay there's the trading happening again it's amazing ea this uh, in uh, from the point of view that somehow it just comes out we haven't had a single failed day yet so um it just somehow works out the balance between the buys and the sells quite nicely cashing in the positives so, uh, there we are it's already done it it's um it's 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 at seven o'clock in, in in the morning it's already cashed in uh, twelve thousand uh, dollars which uh, remember we we trading with an account of ten thousand dollars so every day has been a doubling of the account we on day uh, on the 11th of june already so that give, again gives you a good idea of the speed at which it uh, achieves its, its goals so let's go for the next day Oop. oh it's a bit too fast for me um Okay, so there's the next day again, very, very sideways, and then suddenly it, it got a bit of a sell phase and uh, cashed in a lot of sells. And let's see what happens overall. This is the 14th of June. Oh, all right, so there we are. Just stop it. Um, all right, there, 13,200 cashed in all those buys at that particular point and there were fewer buy uh, there were more buys than sells and that's why the profit was reached also all of these cashed in amounts really add up uh, to that total over there so let's keep on going and as you can see the the targets have <laughs> never actually been hit uh, uh, hopefully we'll see a few targets being hit later on so the target really could be anything at this stage here we are start uh, trading starting for the next day let's see if we can get a target hit uses more or less the grid trend multiplier a concept of cashing in the positive trades as it's trading and then uh, when the overall result becomes a lot positive obviously that's that's when it stops trading okay we're close to a oops thought we were close to some targets soon okay there we are so it's cashed in again um 14,000 this time again sometimes it 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 it, um, it does go over the that particular mark there but again the targets haven't been hit it's all been based on uh, cashing the most positive trade and then cashing in that all of them when the target is hit so let's keep on going all right this is going to be a long video but don't worry <laughs> I think it's worth it if you've um, watched it. You can always fast forward through the video as you're watching it. But uh, the point here is that so far we did have not had a single failure. It's reached, uh, it's doubled the account every single day.
should start okay there, there's the start you can see how narrow the uh, range is that it's trading in extremely narrow um virtually no volatility and there it's starting to cash in positive trades as it's going along and uh and so on let's have a look there we go cashing in positive trades as it's going on and nowhere close to the the targets oops there we are okay so let's stop it again so you know in a extremely narrow range i mean let's let's, let's actually measure the range Oh, it is a 40, 45 pip range. That's very really strange because, no, oh, that's 55. Okay, yeah, so it's a very really narrow range overall, uh, 40, 40 pip range. It, um, it has cashed in again nicely positive. Um, and bear in mind, this is over 100% return every single day. Okay, there we go. Trading starts again. A narrow range. There's this target stop, so it's way out of out of line. And there, there the target gets hit again. Twelve thousand dollars, and we do. I'll just stop this. For, uh, that's oh, can't really see that very well. Um, maybe I should grid the grid. Okay, yeah, that's a bit better. Okay, so uh, let's go on. It's now the seventeenth of June, and we still haven't had a loss yet, so that's pretty good. Oh, oops. <laughs> caught me a bit too fast there. There we go. It's, uh, I think there might have been a few targets hit here. May have. I'm not sure. There we are. Okay. Let's stop again. So this is the 18th of June. Very nice trend. Lots of cashing in. And then obviously those buys, which is blue, were cashed in at a, as a negative. But there were enough uh sales cashed in over here to warrant a 14,000 gain so let's start for the next day so this is the 18th of, of June now remember this is making 14 uh, this is making roughly 12,000 or more a day based on an account of ten thousand dollars so uh, we are looking at a an excess of an excess of a hundred percent return every single day now while we're watching this uh, i think it's important to realize that uh, we are still in the testing phase there's still a lot of work to be done that's why we have another three weeks of beta testing that will take place and uh, oops there we go that was that was a big trend um i think some targets may have been hit there uh, and there we go we'll just stop it and there's the target of 12 uh, 13000 being hit uh, and as i was saying um it is still in early days i'm just giving you an early warning that we found something really really special um, this is fully automated uh, there's no input there is no input required once you've set it up and run it you and it's running uh, there's <laughs> you, you, you it's a basically a set and forget situation as you see now i haven't interfered at all once so uh, let's uh, go, what's now the 21st of june let's see what happens next and i'll fast forward this a little bit i just battle to 
to stop in time sometimes. Yep, that's about right. Okay, here it starts. Okay, so now we're on the 22nd of June. And you can see that's a whipsaw. Right up, right down, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a complete whipsaw type of formation. Uh, we've seen all kinds of price action from being flat to trending to whipsawing. And there's a double whipsaw that just happened here. And let's just see what happens with this particular day. Oh, all right, there we go. It's um, it's uh, hit its target. Uh, as I say, if we look back here, lots of whipsawing all over the show. Very wild, in fact, very wild price action going on here. And uh, it hit its target. So away we go again. So, so far we haven't had a loss. Uh, we're trading quite nicely on a set and forget automated basis and let's see where the next day starts oh, i've still got a bit of time i'm just going to see if i can forward it a little bit it's so so fast okay it, it, it doesn't have a in between it's either very fast okay i think it's going to start trading soon okay there we are so it's trading this is the 23rd of june Now you can, see, you can see the price action has been different every single day, up and down, up and down. And now, now let, let's have a look. I think we've actually hit a few, few. Uh, no, does my might not have hit the the um, targets. But there was a nice uh, oh there we, uh, trend, and here we go. Price uh, uh, oh twenty two thousand. How did that happen? 22,000 in one day. Oh, oh, there's a very, very fast price action, um, price movement that happened there. That's why it sometimes jumps over its target tremendously. There's a 22,000 day. So that that means we, based on a $10,000 account, it has doubled twice. Whoa, that's amazing. Just having a look at the, at, at, at the closing. See, all that's all positive. That's all positive. Only those, only that small group there is negative. But it's it's balanced off by that group there. So so this area is hedged, and then that is cashing in. So that's most probably why it's doing so particularly well. Right. So let's go now. Remember this twenty two thousand because. Uh, that's quite a big jump and and still we haven't had a negative and it's, uh, it's still early in the in the day so I'll just forward it right Let's see how flat it goes the market okay there we go we're opening trades again See, no cashing in happening right now. It, it'll hit the, its limit and then start. There we are. It's hit its limit and start cashing in all the positives uh, pretty soon. And there we go. This one seems to be quite close to its targets and stops. Oh, that was quick. Stop. Okay, now again, this one ran over a bit 17,000. So we've had a 22,000 and we've had a 17,000. That's 40,000 in two days. That's pretty good. And away we go again. Um, we are, uh, and we still haven't had a loss. This is now the 24th of June.
Okay, trading started again. Started to cash in the positives, cash in the positives. So let's see how this day goes. And again, you can see huge variations in the um, in the price action from day to day, or all, all kinds of price action that we've witnessed. Okay, let's see if how far are we still far from the from the take profits. Yeah. Right, it doesn't seem to be resolving much at the moment. Um, it's it's actually at a point. Uh, there we are. Okay, it's it's cashing in some positives, but it's running out of options to cash positives in. So, what, what's what's probably happening here is that it only has negatives running at the moment, and it's um, and okay, there we are. I could see that that it was a, that wasn't a good day. Um, let's just stop that. All right, so what's happened here is we've made a $40,000 loss. Now, that's based on whatever the setting was, based on your loss of equity. Uh, $40,000 is, is actually based on the equity as it stands at the moment, not the 10000 equity. It's based on the equity that you've built up over the history of the trading so if we look at that, uh, in the last two trades, we actually made that 40,000. Remember, it was 22,000 and 17,000. So in the last three trades, we've broken even. That's by, But this, this is the 28th of June. It is the first loss that was encountered out of probably... Uh, uh, 20 trades so out of 20 trades there there's only been one loss so let's just run on so so there we are we have we've actually incurred a loss there um, and probably just the price action that happened on that particular day was particularly not suited um, the remember our equity must be in the region of uh, almost 300,000 dollars at the moment that's why the 40,000 looks like a big number but it's actually based on equity of of uh, three 300,000 which is about 10 percent or 15 percent of equity okay another funny day of of price movement can you see the the whoops the up and down up and down waviness of this particular uh, price action uh Let's see what, what, what it turns out to do. Is this going to be an up? Oh, okay, so this was not another loss. This uh, this one reached its profit. And it's almost the end of June, so uh, let's just run through that. So essentially, so far, one loss and all profits so far for the month of June. Okay, this is a bit of a long video, but I think it's important that you see the EA trading in action there. It's just started right now. Again, you don't, obviously don't need to watch the screens. This is just a, uh, to show you how the EA works and how it, it cashes in uh, its trades uh, um, on an ongoing basis as a price action happens no matter what the price action now that we've had we have had one loss and uh, there is the um, there is the uh, profit for today 30, 33 uh, three, 13,300 and there we go. Okay, I'll just forward that a bit. It made that profit very early in the day. 
Okay, they're starting, the, and I think this is the 30th, so this is the last day. Uh, there's a big run right right in the beginning, a nice trend, um, but it came back, so it's a whipsaw trend, and now it's going the other direction. So this is, it just shows you these, the price action is quite wild, and that's why, you know, trading over, overall is, is quite tricky uh, when you when you see it in this in the way we're looking at it now how the price just goes wherever it wants to and there we go it is um uh that is almost fifteen thousand dollars for the day uh, and i'm just going to let it run to the end and let's see i should end right now pretty soon Okay, so look, I hope you found this interesting. Uh, you know, uh, you, you've seen this EA trade through the most crazy price action that you've ever can imagine. And it has come out tops 95% uh, of the time. And what we lost in that one time was is basically made up in two or three days of profit. So uh, the risk return ratio on this kind of trading is pretty good. Um, okay, so I hope you found this video interesting. Uh, I must warn you, this is just the start of testing. This is very early in the game. Don't get overly excited, but certainly I'm a bit excited because this is a pretty successful EA and I, I, sometimes I don't understand the logic, but I can see the systematic buildup of profits over the life of a day's trading. Um, again, ha, uh, if you need to have a look at, a relook at some of the parts of the video, I will try and put a timeline in so that you can go to the various aspects of the video to have a look at them in a little bit more detail very easily i'll have a timeline that you can click on and go into uh, those aspects that timeline will be in the description of the video as well as in the commentary of the video also consider purchasing the make money because if you purchase it today even without the ch the, the, the changes built in uh, you will get the update or the upgrade for free if you want to uh, just test the make money, then obviously, um, hopefully you are a member of the forum or just simply go and join the forum and you'll get access to the beta version of this EA for, for free to test as a paid member. So from me, Alex Deploy, cheerio.